What's going on everybody? It's Jose and Alyssa and welcome back to another video. So in today's video, <laughs> in today's video, we're going to talk about uh, the movie 8. Um, we've just seen it in theaters. Um, Probably one of the most anticipated scary movies of the year. Um, you know, Pennywise does come out every 27 years. Shit. Um, yeah, that's what thought. Um, it was a really good movie. Um, it's to me it was scary, but like there was only like some jump, like what do you call it? Like, jump scare. Jump scare. Um, but overall, I thought it was like a really good movie. They did really good with this one. Obviously, it's nothing compared to the, the original. But I would, I would definitely recommend it. Um, yeah, my initial thoughts were um, um, very scary. It was a scary movie. And uh, fun fact, I am terrified of clowns. Um, whatever the phobia is for clown phobia i have that i have i have clown phobia <laughs> but um for some reason this movie it didn't scare me as much as i thought it would be because as i thought it would because it was more like a like an action-based scary movie whereas um, if you if you see my eyes looking at this car it's trying to take my parking <laughs> But, um, yeah, the movie didn't scare me as much as I, I anticipated because I hate scary movies. But with this one, I honestly, I enjoyed it. Um, would I go see it again? Of course. Would I buy it on DVD or Blu-ray? Of course. Would I watch it on TV? Of course. Um, but with the whole concept of the movie, it was really good. Um, the director did a great job. Um, as Alyssa said, did, it doesn't compare to the original uh, movie because you know nothing beats the original movie. And uh, the original one was almost three and a half hours long. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. Those two parts. Yeah. Um, so with this one, um, it was or a little bit over two hours, I would say, but it it's well worth it. I would go see a movie. So, yeah. What do you like about it? Um, it pretty much, uh, for the most part, stuck to the original. Um, now it's funny because I actually never. Well, not that I never. So what I liked from the movie was it definitely kept the same like storyline from the original. Um, now I, for the original movie, I never actually sat through the entire movie. I pretty much usually just watch like the very beginning until they start flashing back to their adulthood. Um, but yeah, I, I, I really like that. Like, cause you know, a lot of remakes these days, they like add too much things into it that shouldn't be there. And what I didn't, what I disliked about it, um, I don't think I disliked anything. Um, I thought it was just a really good movie. Yeah. You know, what I liked about the movie was, um, you know, you didn't expect what was coming next. Um, everything was so suspenseful from literally the beginning of the movie, where, um, I'm not going to spoil anything, but, um, yeah, from the beginning of the movie to the end, you know, you don't know what, uh, what to expect unless, uh, you know, you see the original and then, um, you know, you get an idea of how the movie's gonna play out. But, um, yeah, from what I this, <laughs> I don't know. A lot of people like selfies these days. <laughs> um, what I 
can't really say what I dislike about it because there's nothing really. I mean, the only thing I would change is make it more scary. You know, uh, make the movie put nightmares into people. You know, not a lot of scary movies these days put nightmares into people like they used to. Like The Exorcist. Uh, Nightmare on Elm Street, Friday the 13th, Michael Myers. Um, but yeah, that's about it. Um, anything else to say? Okay, obviously, she has nothing else to say. So, uh, catch y'all next time, and uh, remember, you'll flow too. <laughs> no, I should cut that out. Boy, if you don't get that should, that should be a blooper, right? That should just be no. That should have been a no. <laughs> I guess so. Alright, y'all. Remember, stay litty.